Hi everyone. We've talked about Module 2 and 3 and I wanted to give you a little heads up on Module 4 because quite a few of you are working ahead and I want to give you some information about, that you'll need before you begin your Module 4. If we take a look at the calendar, You'll see that the next assignment that is due is the on January 26th, Module 3 is due. On February the 2nd, Module 4 is due. Let's take a look at Module 4. You're going to be using some pre-research databases. So you're getting to use databases. This is great for your research. Uh, we'll be doing quite a few, uh, quite a lot of work with databases. So this is a good way to get you started. Your assignment will involve creating a keyword list. We'll do an assessment on that. And this will be on the topic that you have chosen to use this semester. Be sure to look at the information on concept maps, keywords and pre-research. This is important so you'll understand what you're doing with the uh, databases that we're going to be searching. I'm going to switch tabs to the library tab and this is what the uh, library homepage looks like. To locate the databases that you are going to be using in Module 4 you will go to Find Resources, Online Databases by Title, and you'll see that all of the databases are located in alphabetical order. So any database that you wish to use, please feel free. We're going to be using Credo, which is under the C's, of course. It's right here. And if you click on Credo, I've already signed in, but you probably will be prompted for your username and password. That's the same username and password you use to get into Blackboard. But this is where you do your Credo search right here. Okay. Go back to the databases. And we're also going to be using Gale Virtual Reference Library. So if you'll click on the G, here is Gale Virtual Reference Library. This is an NC Live product, but you will access it through the library homepage. And this is how you search the collection in Gale. Okay. If you have any questions, please let me know. I'm happy to help you. I just wanted to make sure you knew how to get to the databases that you will be using for Module 4. Let me know if you have any questions. Happy to help.